Ladies and gentlemen, this is Scott Pollock, Chief Editor of the Critical Post Chicago Reporting. Welcome to another edition of the Critical Post Chicago Report. Thanks again for tuning us in, ladies and gentlemen. We appreciate it. This edition of the Critical Post Chicago Report is coming to you live, or almost live, from the capital of the Midwest Coast, Chicago, Illinois, USA. Ladies and gentlemen, there are four items in today's broadcast about the things that matter to give you an update about what is happening on the national scene. The four items are as follows. Item 1. Since our report about Dr. Michael Herzog aired, our sources have confirmed to us over the weekend of the 8th and 9th of June that Herzog had been moved out of Germany and into Poland. We presume the move to be for some kind of a rendition to find out exactly what it is that Herzog intends to spill the beans about if he's forced to give back his money that was stolen from Mr. Edward Falcone. Who did the move? And whom is renditioning Herzog? If, in fact, renditioning is occurring, uh, we do not know as of this date. Again, Dr. Michael Herzog is no longer in Germany. He has been moved to an undisclosed location in Poland. We will further update the audience when we know what has happened, where, and by whom. Item 2. The Marine raid last November of CIA headquarters at Langley, Virginia. Regarding this raid, officials high up in the chain of command within the Trump administration told the Marine raiders where exactly to look for quote-unquote critical information which was removed from CIA headquarters on that raid. Personally, I tend to believe it was where to look for the files on Epstein, Wiener, and other salacious materials, and others. I cannot confirm the Epstein files is what they were looking for, what they were after, but I wouldn't be surprised. Item 3. Most importantly, and nobody has reported this, Our sources have confirmed to us that as many as six attempts to assassinate President Trump have been thwarted during the time of his presidency, and that the Marines, whom have been dispatched to protect the president, has been effective. As a matter of fact, after the uh, Trump and Kim summit in Singapore, we heard that a decoy uh, plane a decoy uh, 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 Air Force One, uh, that an attempt was uh, made to shoot it down. Uh, I cannot uh, give you any further information than that, but that was thwarted. Item four. There are going to be further OIG reports to follow the disappointing OIG report from last Thursday. One of the OIG reports are expected to be as early as tomorrow, Tuesday, the 19th of June, 2018. And there's going to be one following that. Exactly 
what these are, uh, we are surmising that's going to be about Horowitz and other people close to uh, the uh, uh, Mueller investigation. Uh, and it's going to have uh, stuff in there from the OIG about all of that. Uh, that's all I know as of this date. Again, this is Scott Pollack, Chief Editor of the Critical Post Chicago Reporting. Thanks again for watching another Critical Post Chicago Report coming to you live or almost live from the capital of the Midwest Coast, Chicago, Illinois, USA. That is all.